Hi everyone, I'm going to show off the first of my favorite tips from my sneak peek of our upcoming Improve Your Outlook program, and that is how to add time zones to your appointments in your Outlook calendar. So on April 4th, I'm going to my very first ABA Tech show, and so what I'm going to do is add that to my calendar using the time zone features in Outlook. What I'm going to do is click on New Appointment, and I'm going to say ABA Tech Show Starts. Go ahead and add a location, Chicago. And then I am going to set, make up an end time for you guys. We'll say 3 o'clock. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to this button that I had never noticed until I got my sneak peek called Time Zones. And when I click that, what it does is it adds this new field where I can tell Outlook what time zone this appointment is in. So I'm going to go ahead and go up and select Central Time. As you can see, it changed from Central, from Start Time and the End Time. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit Save and Close. And when I do that, when you get back to my traditional calendar view, which is set for Eastern Time, you will notice that it has the ABA Tech Show showing as 10 to 4, showing how Outlook automatically converted that time for me into my normal calendar time, which is Eastern. I, for one, am really looking forward to using this going forward, uh, and I think you will too if you, like me, have a lot of appointments with clients or other attorneys all over the United States, and you really want to make sure that once you pick a time and you send that email out to everyone with your appointment, that everyone shows at the right time, no matter where they are in the United States.